Good night, Pixies. How are you tonight? I hope you all are doing very well out there on the streets of London. I hope you all are doing much better than I am. So we are here with another quick vlog. The kitchen is spotless. I spent the entire day cleaning. I went out, ran some errands, came back at home, cleaned it. It's pristine. It smells like bleach. It smells like um, Glade plugins. And definitely looking forward to purchasing some more candles. I bought some candle minis um, the other day, but I prefer the um, large candles, like three wick candles. Uh, you can pick them up at the mall, whatever. You can order them online. It really doesn't matter. Um, so here is my Starbies cold cup um, with some water with lemon. And here we have lilies. So we have our pink lilies going on. Looks very cute, very nice, perfect for spring. And yes, I do love flowers. Anybody who knows me knows that I am obsessed with everything floral. And I love um, dried flowers as well. So I'm waiting on a order from Walmart to come in. And as soon as that order arrives, I am going to be whipping up some lemon cake minis. Um, so let me get prepared for that. So we have a few lemons right there. We have a few lemons right there. And then these are going to be the pans that I use to bake the goodies in. Um, so here we have a guard. I need to wash this. And this basically goes on the kitchen aid. Yes, this is my kitchen aid from home. My mom sent it to me. It's used. Um, whatever. Going to wash this out. Use the guard, and then we're going to get going, um, mixing and making my lovely uh, lemon cakes tonight. Unfortunately, there was no poppy seed available for delivery. Otherwise, I would have made lemon poppy seed. Um, but like I said, I would like to go full scale Caribbean instead of making something that's, you know, normal lemon poppy seed is more like normal, but I'm in the mood for lemon poppy seed. It is a favorite of mine. It tastes amazing. Um, but really and truly, I am going to be, uh, experimenting with recipes from home. So I want to try making things like coconut tarts, um, pineapple tart minis, all of those different kinds of things I'm going to be doing from home in a bit. Yes, that's the people down in the basement. Um, I don't know if you can hear them in the background or not, but I'm sorry about that. But sooner or later, I've been checking around trying to find the right guava to make uh, guava duff, different kinds of things like that. Just the taste of home. I just honestly miss the taste of home. Um, I make baked macaroni, that kind of thing at home because I miss the taste of home. Um, I am not a person who actually cooks. Anyone who has lived with me knows that I simply do not cook. Or if I do cook, it's going to be something basic. It's not going to be um, that deep because I, I, am, I am not that kind of person. You see, I'm tired from working. I come home, I'm exhausted. Cooking, not my thing. Baking, yes. But the kitchen is spotless as always. I am very OCD. I'm very particular about how my place, place looks and how it smells. Um, yes, so this is it. Um, floor is clean, um, perfectly clean, squeaky, bleached. I always leave my shoes by the door. I do not like germs. Shoes coming in from the outside, you can have cysts coming in, um, attaching themselves to the bottom of your shoes all kinds of other micro um, microorganisms coming inside. I don't want that. So shoes come off at the door, bleach the floor to completion, and then it's all clean, good to go. Bathroom, spotless. Half bathroom is spotless. So there, and then we got this little cheap thing from the Dollarama. Um, like I said, I don't have the kind of funds right now to buy like real art but for right now that suffices um it makes me feel like i'm somewhat adulting 
You know what I mean? It makes me feel like I'm somewhat adulting enough to say, you know what? You know what I mean? Get the idea of what it might be like to be like a rich housewife one day and have actual art in my pristine castle. So yeah, so in the fridge, we don't have much going right now. Um, waiting on that order to come in so that I can start cooking. Um, so that I can start cooking. And then, of course, we have my cookbooks because, I, like I said, I don't know what a stove is. Um, but I can read and follow instructions. And I bought these cookbooks when from the time I first arrived in Canada. Um, oh, she glows. And I have been trying to switch my diet into something more healthy, more plant-based. Um, yes, I am a meat, meat eater. Um, and I do love organic foods. Here in Canada, it is so easy to eat fresh, to eat organic, to live healthier, to look younger, and strive to be a more healthy individual. And like I said, I don't think that I will ever give up meat. I love a good steak. Um, however, um, if I want to look younger, if I want to feel better, if I want to stay, um, have